guys, so today I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing some Kira outfits and accessories. So if you are new to my channel, welcome. Be sure to click on the subscribe button down below and the notification bell in the corner is notified every time I upload a new video. This video is a shopper's gift guide so shoppers can determine whether or not they'd like to purchase these items. And I did just want to say a huge thank you to American Girl for gifting me these items so I'm able to open and review them on my channel. Kira Bailey is the girl of the year for 2021 and her collection is themed around Australia. So let's go ahead and take a look at the first item. So the first outfit and accessory set I'll be opening and reviewing are themed to wildlife and animal care. So this first outfit is called Kira's Wildlife Care Outfit. There's a photo on the front of the box to give an overview of the outfit with the accessory items too. So the first item we have here is the scrubs top and it's themed to Australian animals. There's different styles here. There's a koala, a kangaroo, and there's different animals like a wombat and a kookaburra as well. There's pockets at the front. There's a total of two. And we also have the lighter purple also on the top of the scrubs top. If we take a look at the back, there's Velcro. And up next, we have the scrub pants. They do match the pockets a part of the scrubs top. They're the lighter purple and they're stitching at the bottom. And then there's elastic on the waist. This item here is really great because it can be used as a mix and match item. It can be used for this outfit in particular, but you can also pair it with a pair of shorts or pants. It is a long sleeve purple shirt and there's Velcro on the back too. There are some accessories as well. There is a stethoscope on one side and over here we have some hair clips. There's a total of two and they match the headband a part of one of Kira's outfits. They're just made out of a lightweight plastic material and they open and close like so. Another mix and match item a part of the outfit that you can style with any outfit choice are the sneakers. They're a lovely purple color and there's elastic on the top here. So this piece of fabric underneath is attached to one side of the shoe and then the other side is open so you're able to add the foot in place. Here we have an overview of Kira's Wildlife Care outfit. It's really great how it comes with some accessories and it's perfect for Kira's storyline as well. This item is an accessory set and it's called Kira's Wallaby Care Set. There's a photo on the front of the box to give an overview of the different accessory items. So just before I show you the different items, I wanted to show you the tissue paper that was a part of the accessory set. When I opened it up, I noticed something really strange. The tissue paper from the accessory set actually had Christmas paper on it. There's Christmas trees on it and snowflakes. It's very pretty, but I'm not sure why that's a part of Kira's collection. As referred to the outfit, it has the classic star American Girl tissue. So I don't know if it's wrong or it comes with all the other accessory items, but I thought it'd be an interesting note to point out. So the first item that's a part of the set is the pouch. It has a stripe design on it that's blue, purple, and orange. And there's also a piece of Velcro at the top, so you're able to open and close that as well. It is so incredibly soft inside. It feels like a plush material, so very cozy and warm for the wallaby. The main feature item would definitely have to be the wallaby joey. It's quite small because it's meant to be a baby, which is why it's a joey. It has bead eyes, and it's a classic plush. And the last item is a bottle. It's made out of a lightweight plastic material and it has measurements at the front. So just to give you an idea of the sizing of all of the different items, the bottle is quite large next to the Wallaby Joey, but I love how it holds onto it. And then you can also place it into the bag as well. And it does fit too with the bottle as well. This is definitely one of the smaller accessory sets, a part of Kira's collection, but I would definitely recommend it. It ties along perfectly with the wildlife care storyline. So let's go ahead and take a look at some more items, a part of Kira's collection. And the main feature item a part of Kira's collection is Kira's Comfy Platform Tent. It retails for $225 and it comes with the platform tent itself along with multiple different accessories and items so you're able to decorate it. So now that we've removed the packaging from the items, let's go ahead and set up the tent. So since it is meant to be a platform tent, it's meant to be raised off of the ground. So all I'm doing right now is adding a few attachments to the set. And there's also an attachment at the front of the tent to be able to add in some stairs. And there's a clip on either side of the tent itself, so it should be able to stay. The set does come with a cover that you can place over the tent itself. And there are a few connectors and poles, so it's able to stay up. So all I'm doing right now is connecting the connector and the poles together like so. There is a small little instruction booklet, so it's really easy to follow along so you know exactly what to place where. As you can see, there are different styles of connectors and there's also different size poles as well, so you're able to make the shape of the tent itself. And I'm just adding in the final few poles and connector pieces together and it should be completely set up, but I just wanted to make sure I had the right sizing and idea of it, but there are netting pieces that you're meant to add to the poles. So that's what I'm going to do now. It's a gorgeous light pink color and I'm just making sure it spreads out evenly and I'll connect the pole back together and there's one for either side of the tent. 
And now the next step is to add the structure to the platform and there are a total of four attachments that are on the bottom of the platform there so I'm just making sure everything stays like so. And once everything is in place the next step is to add the cover over the top of the structure itself. It does have a really lovely design and it's not too bright and it matches a lot of the other accessories a part of the set as well. So there are two pieces of ribbon one on either side so you're able to tie it to the pole so it's able to stay in place. So I'm just going to tie a bow on either side. And as you can see, this item covers both sides of the top of the platform tent and also the entire back section too. Let's go ahead and add in the different accessories that are a part of the set. The first item we have here is the mattress. It's a lovely light pink color to match a lot of the accessories a part of the set. It is quite large, so we're just going to be placing it towards the side of the tent. And the next item we have here is the blanket. It's a purple and pink color. It has a lovely design on the front and it's a very thin material. The set also comes with a pillow and a throw pillow. So the pillow itself is a light pink color to match the mattress. And then the throw pillow features a koala. And I love the mint green featured on the pillow too. What I really like about the set is how you can decorate it. So there are these hook attachments that you can place towards the back of the tent and you can move them around depending on where you want to display the different items. So I placed the hook just towards the side here so I can display this Wildflowers of Australia poster. And there are a total of six different types of flowers on the poster itself. Another decor item that's a part of the set is this clothes pin photo hanger and there's a total of eight photos and four clips so you can choose to display four photos at a time and the photos are themed to different Australian nature scenes and also wildlife too. And as for the clips itself, they don't open and close, they stay in place and once you place them into the clip, they just stay like so. So the photos that I ended up choosing to display was a beach scene, a kookaburra photo, a koala photo and a kangaroo one too. So all I've done is I've placed one of those hook attachments to the back of the platform tent and I'm just adding the clothespin photo hanger to the back so it's able to be displayed. And I think this is a wonderful decor item to be featured in the room and it suits the poster perfectly. And as for the other side of the room, I'll be placing down the vanity. There is a sink that's attached to one side of the vanity and there are two cubes for storage. So over towards one side, I'll be placing down some dry shampoo and as you can see, the bottle is very bright and colorful. There's also a tissue box with a lovely flower design at the front and then towards the other side, I have some towels and there is a total of two and they're identical. So now that we've organized the storage section of the vanity table, let's go ahead and display some items next to the sink. So first off, we have some beach rose hand soap, and then there's also some insect repellent as well, and there's a picture of a lavender at the front. And right in front of that, I'll be adding in a toothbrush, and that's a really bright orange color, and then we also have a tube of toothpaste. And right towards the side of the bed, I'll just be placing down a magazine and it says Aussie animals on the front and it features different photos and information about different Australian animals. One of my favorite furniture items a part of the set would definitely have to be this seat cushion. It is so soft and it's very lightweight as well. I love it a part of this room setup and it's so pretty too. So all I'm doing right now is placing the photos I didn't choose to display and then we also have a camera too. There is a hook that's already attached to either side of the platform tent, so I'm going to be placing the sign on one of them, and it says welcome on one side and good day on the other side. And what's really great about the mirror is that there is an attachment on the back, so you're able to clip it to the back pole so you can choose whether or not to display it. And as for the front of the tent, there is this gorgeous decor item that's a lovely light pink color to match the netting that's already been displayed towards the side. So all I'm doing right now is attaching it to the pole. There are a few Velcro pieces so it's able to stay in place. And I do have one more item to add to the platform tent itself and it is a lantern. It's such a pretty gold color and I'll be displaying it at the front. It does come with batteries and it does flicker to make it look as realistic as possible. Here we have an overview of Kira's comfy platform tent completely set up with all of the different accessories and items. It's definitely a really wonderful set and it's perfect for Kira's collection. So here we have Kira Bailey, the girl of the year for 2021. Her name is at the front of the box and there's a small koala towards the side. The box is mainly purple but there's also a photo of the doll, her outfit and her book as well. So let's remove the lid so we're able to take her out of the box. There's also a window towards the front there so you're able to see what she looks like. So she does come with a book and it is called Kira Down Under and then she also has a small accessory item as well. And let's remove the plastic and then we can take her out of the box.
So here we have Kira out of the box with her hairnet on so we can take a look at the outfit itself. We'll be taking a look at the detail of the different items later on but this outfit is so adorable and perfect for her personality and style. She definitely has green eyes and feathered eyebrows as well. So let's go ahead and remove the hairnet. And all I'm doing right now is spreading her hair out so it's a little bit more even as it's been in the hairnet for quite a while. What's really great about her hairstyle is it's very easy to recreate so it's just two twists on either side and it's connected with a single hair tie so I'll definitely be removing her hairstyle later on and then I'll go ahead and recreate that when I'd like to recreate her meat hairstyle. Her hair is a gorgeous blonde color and it has a bit of a wave to it as well. And here we have Kira without the hairnet on. She is a wonderful doll and I'm so excited she's the girl of the year for 2021. And as for Kira's accessories, it does come with quite a few different items. There's a photo here featuring a few of the pieces, including a backpack. So the first item we have here is the hat. So it is brown, but to match the bag, it does have a piece of ribbon that wraps around and there's a bow towards the side as well. So you can see there is some detail on the top here and here's what the hat looks like underneath. It is made out of a lightweight felt material as well. The set also comes with two photos and two postcards. So the two postcards are over here. It says Australia in the front. You can see this one features different landmarks and animals, while this one just features a map of Australia with different landmarks as well. There's also two photos. There's some kangaroos and there's a koala. And if you take a look at the other side of the postcard, there's writing and they're both for her friend, Layla. My favorite item in the set would definitely have to be the koala keychain. It is so adorable. So it features a tiny little koala and it's attached to a keychain and you can go ahead and open and close it so you can attach it to the backpack. And of course you can attach this to your own pencil case if you'd like as well. The backpack itself is quite large so you should be able to fit a lot of different accessories and items inside and there's also different pockets as well. So this design at the front and also on the top here matches the sleeves of her jacket, part of her collection, and then the purple itself matches her jumper, part of her collection too. So when you open it up, there's a small pocket at the front and that's Velcro. Then there's two pockets towards the side and there's a zipper so you're able to open and close them. And then we also have the main pocket at the top, which you can completely open up. And you can see it's quite large, so you definitely be able to fit a lot of items. And then there's also some straps at the back too. Here we have an overview of Kira's accessories. My favorite item would definitely have to be the koala keychain, but the backpack and hat's really adorable too. One of my favorite clothing items in Kira's collection would definitely have to be your PJs. They're themed to koalas. It comes with a t-shirt, a pair of pants, and some slippers as well. And they're called Kira's Koala PJs. So let's open it up. So the first item we have here are the pants. It's mint green on the top and also on the bottom and there's elastic on the waist as well. There's a ribbon at the front and there's a koala print both on the front of the pants and the back too. And the next item here is the PJs. There's two koalas. There's a smaller one and one that's slightly larger and it's made out of a felt material rather than a graphic print and there's a leaf design around it and then towards the back there's velcro. And my favorite item for the set would definitely have to be the slippers. They match the koala theme perfectly. There's a little koala face on the front and there's little ears and it also matches the inside of the slippers too and they're so incredibly soft. So the outside of it is gray and here's the bottom. Here we have an overview of the outfit. I love the mint green theme and all of the koala items are so adorable as well. Kira does come with quite a few different animals in her collection. This animal here is a koala. The set does only come with one item, which is the koala itself, and it's surprisingly quite large. I expect it to be a lot smaller, but it is so adorable, and it looks exactly like a koala too. You can see it is so incredibly soft, and you can see all the detail a part of the set as well. This outfit is called Kira's Camping Outfit. There's a photo on the front of the box. It comes with quite a few different items, and it's very bright and colorful. So the first item we have here is the jumper. It is very thin and lightweight and it's a very bright purple color. There's some stitching along the top here and it's short sleeved as well and there's a bow in the middle. On the back there's velcro so you're able to open and close it and there's some stitching along the side. 
And the next item we have here is the t-shirt. It's a bright yellow color and I love the design on the sleeves and there's Velcro on the back as well. This t-shirt's really great because you can style it as a mix and match item. So you can have it with a skirt and shorts. You don't just have to have it with the jumper itself. Here we have the headband. There are two different colors. I'd say this is more of a pink rather than a purple color. And then on this side, it's yellow. The two pieces of ribbon are connected together like so. And there's elastic at the bottom, so it should be able to look like this in Kira's hair. And the final item we have here are the sandals. So they're mainly purple and it matches the stitching that's featured on the jumper. And there's elastic at the back as well. And that wraps around the doll's foot. This outfit is so great for Kira and her personality. So let's go ahead and move right along to the next item. And this outfit is called Kira's Casual Outfit. It does come with quite a few different items and there's a photo on the front of the box to give an overview of the set itself. I'd love to see what the t-shirt looks like because it features Australia. So let's open it up. My favorite item and part of the set would definitely have to be the t-shirt. It is completely plain except for this graphic design at the front. So it says Australia and it features a map of the country and it has different landmarks on it. So here we have the Opera House, there's also a koala and it says Great Barrier Reef over there. And then there is Velcro on the back. And the next item we have here is the skirt. So there is no elastic on the waist. Instead there's Velcro and you can open and close it like so. And there's a ruffle design that wraps around the side and also on the bottom. It is such a pretty blue color and it wraps around to the back too. And a great addition to this outfit would definitely have to be the vest. It's a light pink color and there are some buttons along the middle and also on the side next to the pockets and towards the back there's some stitching as well. And here we have the shoes and the headband. I love how the shoes match the vest. They're both that light pink color and there is a piece of Velcro which opens up like so. So you're able to add the doll's foot in and here's the bottom of the shoe. There is a little bit of a platform and then the headband has elastic at the back there and it features purple, blue and yellow too. This outfit definitely has some really great mix and match items. I love the t-shirt and how it's themed to Australia and the skirt is so pretty as well. This here is another Australian animal part of Kira's collection and it is Kira's kangaroo and joey and the joey fits inside of the pouch so you can see the joey is so small and then we have the kangaroo itself. So here we have the kangaroo, it is actually quite large so it's brown and there's also some white, there's some white along the tummy there and then we also have the pouch too which opens up and it's made out of an elastic material so it does stretch so it seems like it's just a stomach like that but when you open it up it has a spare pouch so the joey can be there. And here we have a comparison in sizing of the kangaroo and the koala and I'd say the koala is a lot smaller than the kangaroo itself but both animals are quite large compared to the normal American girl pets like the dogs or cats. And here we have the joey. It is so adorable, but let's go ahead and see if the joey fits in the kangaroo pouch. And here we have the kangaroo and the joey together. So the joey does fit within the pouch there and it's just an elastic so it opens up so you're able to add the joey inside of the pouch. This is so adorable and it ties along with the koala set perfectly too. This accessory set is called Kira's Outdoor Accessories. There's a photo on the front of the box and the set comes with a jacket, a scarf, and a pair of sunglasses too. So the main feature item part of the set would definitely have to be the jacket itself. It's very lightweight, so perfect for the outdoors. The main jacket is brown, but there's also some purple as well. So there's some purple stitching, and so are the strings over towards the side. And they do tighten as well, which I really like. It just makes it more realistic. There's a total of four pockets, so the top two are sewn on, while these ones are actual working pockets, which are really great. There's a lovely flower design, and the zipper does open and close, and the design on the sleeves and the back collar are so pretty as well, and here's what the back looks like. And the next item we have here is the scarf. It's purple to match the sleeves of the jacket, and the design wraps around to the back as well, and there's a piece of velcro at the front, so you're able to open and close it. And the final item we have here are the sunglasses. They're perfect for an outdoor set and they're made out of a lightweight plastic material. This set is the perfect add-on set to Kira as the jacket, the scarf, and sunglasses tie along with her meat outfit perfectly. And this accessory set is called Kira's Wildlife Rescue Set. There's a photo on the front of the box and it features a wombat with a few different accessories for it too.
So here we have a few small accessories a part of the set. First off, there's a bandage. It is very stretchy, so you're able to wrap it around the wombat. And there's a small piece of Velcro on the side here, so it's able to attach like so. And then there's a walkie-talkie, and that's mainly yellow. It does say Kira's name on the top, and then the screen is purple. There's a clip on the back, so you're able to attach it. And then we also have a pair of binoculars. And what I like about the set is that there's a handle on either side. Here we have the blanket. It's a lovely mint green color to match a lot of the items in Kira's collection. And it's also really great sizing too because it should be able to fit in the animal carrier. And here's what the other side looks like. It's completely plain. So here we have the wagon itself. There is a handle so you're able to move it around and the wheels do actually spin and there's a total of four, two at the front and two at the back. It's a gorgeous teal blue color and it's very lightweight as it's made out of a plastic material and the back does open so you're able to have the carrier open like so. What I like about the wheels is that they do turn so you're able to turn it around and this is what it looks like from underneath. So you have these two wheels connected but you can have this one and that completely moves from side to side. And here we have an animal carrier. It's orange at the top and purple at the bottom. There is a handle at the top and it's made out of a very lightweight plastic material so it's easy to carry around and this section does open and close. And the main feature item of the set would definitely have to be the wombat itself. It's a classic plush wombat and it has the bead eyes to match the other animals a part of the collection. So just to show you an idea of the sizing of the animal carrier, I'm going to go ahead and open it up and I'm going to place the wombat inside and it should be able to fit because the set is made for this particular animal. I'm going to close it and then I'm going to turn this to the back so we can open this section up and then we can have it sit there like so. So you have a choice of leaving this open like that or else you can close it and then you can close this up and it's all connected together. And here we have an overview of everything a part of the set. It does come with some really great items, and I love the Wombat so much, and it's perfect for Kira's storyline too. And this accessory set is called Kira's Comfy Camping Accessories. It says the lantern lights up, and it features some chairs, also a cushion with a kangaroo on it, and a few different food items. The item I'm most excited about is definitely the fairy bread. You can see there's two pieces of fairy bread on the plates. So the first item we have here is the table itself. It's quite low to the ground and I love the style of this item. It is quite heavy so it shouldn't be able to move around too much and in case if you're wondering, here's what the bottom looks like. There are a few food items a part of the set. So here we have two plates. They're a gorgeous green color and they're themed to leaves. And here we have some fruit. There's a total of two. So there's small pieces of fruit like raspberry and mango and then there's the main fruit itself as a bowl. And here we have two drinks, so it seems like it's a pink drink, and then you can see the straw inside, and there's also some ice cube pieces at the top. So I would normally say it's pink lemonade, but pink lemonade is not very popular in Australia, but cordial is, so I'm going to say it's two glasses of cordial. My favorite item part of the set would definitely have to be the fairy bread. I'm so excited about this. So if you don't know what fairy bread is, it's very common at kids' birthday parties and events, and it's just something that would be at the snack table. So it's meant to be white bread and you're not meant to have it toasted or anything, it's just meant to be fresh. And then you're meant to add lots of butter and then you're meant to add sprinkles, but not normal sprinkles. It has to be hundreds and thousands sprinkles. So I love how they included this in the set because it's so popular in Australia and everybody loves them so much. So you can see all of the hundreds and thousands sprinkles. They're meant to be really small and tiny and it tastes so good as well. It sounds really strange, but it's such a lovely stack. And then if you take a look at the back, it is completely plain. This plant would definitely be a lovely addition to a room setup. You can see it's made out of a plastic material and then the pieces are all connected together like so and the design on the bottom of the pot plant is really pretty. And the next item we have here is a lantern. It's purple and silver and there's a handle on the top so you're able to move it around. It's clear so you're able to see light inside and it does actually switch on. The power button is on at the front and it looks like it flickers. And then you can switch it off when you're done. Another one of my favorite items as part of the set would definitely have to be the pillow. It is so pretty, so it's purple, and then the kangaroo on it is a blue color, and that's just a graphic design, but if you don't want the design of the kangaroo, it's just plain on the back. The rug is really pretty. It's a lovely blue color, and there's such a lovely design in the front, and it features quite a few different flowers as well. And the final items a part of the set are the chairs. There's a total of two, and they're identical. What I like about them is that you can fold them down so they're completely flat, so they're perfect for storage, or else you can have them sitting up like so. There's a total of three different ways, so this is the middle option. Then you can have it a little bit higher, like that, so it's more like a chair, or else you can have it more like a lounge chair. 
then you can have it over in this section. Here we have an overview of the comfy camping accessories. It definitely comes with some great items. I love the chair and the table set and the fairy bread too. It's so great that Kira's collection is themed around Australia and she's a wonderful girl of the year for 2021. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and I really hope you guys enjoyed it.